In this video I will show you how to record your Cubase DAW using NVIDIA Shadow Play. Let me bring this up. If you do have uh, a GeForce GTX 600 and up series or the 600, 7, 8, 900M series you can use NVIDIA Shadow Play. Now if you have any of these uh, graphic cards you don't need a different software to record uh, your monitor. You can just go to NVIDIA website and the easiest way is to download GeForce experience. After you install NVIDIA GeForce you can go to this NVIDIA icon right click on it and then you should have NVIDIA GeForce experience. Now you can open it, go to this icon here and then you have uh, a menu here that you can uh, uh, do different settings. Now the recording settings, you just click on it, customize. The icon I go out there because I'm recording it right now but you can um, uh, set the quality, resolution, frame rates of uh, the video. Then uh, also you can um, stream online on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. You can uh, do that too. You can go live. So here on the microphone icon uh, just go to customize and select your audio interface as a recording device and just click save. Now, there's more options uh, when you click on this uh, icon. You can uh, set up uh, keyboards, shortcuts, uh, it's, it's really easy. So okay so that's NVIDIA GeForce. Now you will need a different software which is voice meter um, from VB Audio. It's a free software. Now I got the banana version because it has more options. Uh, now here you can just scroll down somewhere in the middle. There you go. And you can either click on download get the zip file or just click the uh, install button it doesn't matter you you will get the same files i'll have the links under the description of the video so geforce experience it's set uh, let's go to voice meter so under input 1 you will select your audio interface mine it's it's a turtle beach headset which does have a microphone and that's why it's selected but if you don't have that and you will select your uh, audio interface now uh, select the MME option it does not work for me if, uh, if I select WDM also we'll go on the right side and we have to select the output actually your speakers so mine again it's selected the uh, turtle beach uh, again but you will select your audio interface and then again the MME option. Okay, now a few more steps. Uh, let's go to the Windows uh, speaker icon and then right click on it 
click on playback device now here as you can see uh, I have selected the turtle beach but you will select your uh, audio interface for playback and then the same thing for recording you will select your audio interface okay let's click cancel and final step let's go to Cubase now if I play they can hear me playing this is cinematic strings so here there is one more step you go to devices device setup and then you will have to select your voice meter virtual ASIO driver in order for this to work make sure this is unchecked release driver when application is in background because if you minimize the screen will cut off uh, the sound from Cubase so make sure that's unchecked you click OK and you're good to go well this is it so until next time be safe